Hello! Today is the 1st of February 2022 and today is Chinese New Year. So happy Chinese New Year! And uh, this will be the year of the tiger. Maybe nice if you saw the last, uh, last drawing. And uh, if you're an ox, this will be your year. It's my year, <laughs> I'm an ox. Um, and uh, yeah, so the confession for, for this drawing is, um, or yeah, the confession. Uh, last weekend I was sick to my stomach, very nervous, because my dad called me. And uh, I was actually sort of thinking of my first drawing, like, uh, forgive but not forget and I'm very far away now so I was ready to start talking again so I picked up the phone and um, it's difficult to explain how, how this mechanism works but there was immediately this pressure like I know, I'm not sure if I should say the word narcissism but you know like sort of pressure or draw or like um, so I, I Okay, maybe I should say first what, what was going on. So, um, he lied. He said uh, my godmother had called him and uh, an uncle or the uncle-in-law, is that uncle-in-law, uh, uh, knew about it and the cleaning lady and all my art friends. And at first I was confused because I wrote in the beginning on there in the WeChat. Uh, don't call me anymore. Uh, you kicked and hit me. That's a fact. You can't. Uh, we can't uh, undo that. And um, um, but now I'm thinking. Okay, that means because they never followed my art. Uh, in fact, when I was younger, I really had to fight for my art to be an artist. And um, so they don't follow me. They don't know what I'm, I'm doing. And I, it's been a long time that I don't even try to show them what I'm doing or any because it's just it's yeah um, anyway I'm dragging this too long um, so then so he said um, my godmother uh, uh, call, called him and uh, and she's on on Facebook so I, I wrote to her on Facebook is it true that you called my dad <laughs> And uh, fortunately, she reacted incredibly great, and we started to, to chat back and forth, which was a really good talk because I was really very nervous. Because the thing is, I'm not saying everything. Uh, he wanted me to delete the remarks, and uh, but I guess almost like voluntarily, I always kind of covered it. I never really told anybody about it, only my close friends would know this pro pro trouble, problems with my brother, but, and I never really told anybody, neither. Um, I'm totally losing track of my story, it's way too long, I'm sorry, <laughs> I wanted to just say just a three sentence. Anyway, he wants me to take it all away, and because it's, uh, it's shameful, and um, and first I said, well, I can take it away, it's, it's on which you can just take it, you can delete it from your own phone. But then he said, like, uh, I will not say her name, uh, my godmother, he had called, my godmother had called him. So then I, I, fortunately I could reach her and she said, well, uh, I, I'm, she, he didn't, <laughs> I didn't call him. And, um, well, my father, you know. I will not say compulsory liar, but he lies to get what he wants, and uh, my godmother is not like that. So uh, she's more like almost like spiritual or like really uh, involved with uh, trying to uh, make your life and other people's life better. Um, so yeah, I'm babbling, not babbling, but. Too long but anyway so I was very nervous and then the next day I was also a really nice conversation I had a long talk with Chanta my friend from my youth so very long time ago and she said he can be lucky that you didn't uh, go to she said she you, I should have gone to the police um, but I didn't 
uh, but then this is like really far stretch from then to 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 pressure me or warn from me that I delete it, and I'm not going to delete it because I'm sure there are other people in situations similar like me, and I'm 48. This is crazy. Uh, I should be free from, from my toxic family and still, you know, this ooh, this long arm. <laughs> um, but so I uh, so then yesterday I was in my old apartment to clean. So um, and today is um, the confession drawing, and I was thinking, oh no, I guess I have to face my demons. I have to make a picture of a drawing of my brother, and then I. Yesterday I missed the birthday of my godmother and then I thought, no, actually I'm going to draw my godmother and that's what I'm going to do, to focus on the positive. Because what is the matter with toxic people? You're doing your thing, you're living your life, you're trying to make something good, maybe at least I'm trying to make something good of my life. But then they, there's something and they reach you and they grab you and they, with their negativity or you have to, they, it's like so, there's so much energy there, you're kind of drawn to it. Uh, but it's not for a, good, for a good thing. So enough talking. That's my confession and that will be my drawing for today. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. <laughs> and um, now everything is also done. So every, every new drawing I will try to improve something uh, also of the technique. And uh, so today I noticed my sound is really bad once I have flipped my phone to the drawing. So I will plug in some earphones, which will also work as a microphone, so that you can also understand me maybe better while I'm drawing and uh, I'm going to draw again with the pencils of Libby because they were great I love them so Libby I know you're watching thank you very much you should check also the other video because there I also mentioned you and your pencils and uh, placed your website in the description enjoy the drawing <laughs> bye not bye but my face you know it's all <laughs> Okay, and to improve all this, but so titles for today. I oh, don't see anything. Um, here, I guess. Uh, everything's so good, and then now again the hassle with the again I'm so happy with them and you know why also not only because it's in a tin but you know the lid doesn't stick there you can, it's loose so you can place it underneath so I'm really in love with these pencils they're lovely <laughs> I love them thank you Libby <laughs> she doesn't know uh, that I'm going to, no probably she doesn't know that I'm going to make a drawing of her because I didn't tell anybody so she doesn't know. But this is for all the godmothers in the world. And I took a picture from her from the on my Facebook <laughs> and um, I'm going to use that just like really just the face no hair no much other things around it and uh, just a happy smiling face
because you know I'm not necessarily looking to make a picture that is like a photograph that looks like a perfect uh, portrait photo. Mm -hmm. No, I'm not. I like this kind of big, you know, like big uh, hats or not hats, but <laughs> yeah, like also when I was making video, I like like the framing really really close, so to have people up close, I like that. Um, and uh, yeah, I also wanted to say that another good thing, not a good thing, but. Um, when I, while I was there, because of the corona, I went there, so I lived there for, for a whole year. Uh, and so during this year, because I was there, I think I also, yeah, got, like, I almost wanted to say her name. My godmother is like the bridge, you could say, between my parents and me, I think, yeah. So, so in a way, so, anyway, I'm really lucky and happy mm -hmm. to have her as my godmother and I was thinking about about the name because in in the ne in Dutch the Netherlands we say Peetmoeder but this word godmother is like really great isn't it it's like god and mother it's like the origin of the origin <laughs> so I had some other type of titles uh, I had a very nervous weekend. I tried my best and got mother. And I think it, it it has to become like like here, God, and then mother. Either I tried my best or I had a very nervous weekend. I think if I do, I tried my best. It's like an ending. But if I have, I had a very nervous weekend then it's still going and probably it's going to be that so <laughs> uh, yeah I don't really have to do too much I think I'm going to make uh, a pretty blue eyes I don't actually know if she has blue eyes but I'm going to make blue eyes <coughs> The Facebook picture is also very blurry. I can't really see anything. <laughs> but it doesn't matter. Maybe I start with the glasses. Like a golden... By the way, I saw... Uh, because all, all, all my stuff is in the Netherlands. And that is so difficult. Because every little thing I need, I don't have it. And um, so I was in the, in the store somewhere, probably Corte Inglés, and I saw metallic color pencils. I almost bought them. <laughs> so maybe I, I will go buy them. Me. And she, her, mm, what's this called? Rim of the glasses? That's kind of like metallic. It would have been funny if I would have metallic pencils that I would definitely use them <laughs> but uh, this will be fine so, the glasses. I don't know if you hear, but that's the elevator. This morning I also woke up because of the... Oh, maybe she has brown eyes, actually. I really can't tell. Or maybe one eye is... Oh, that's interesting, like David Bowie. One eye is blue and one eye is brown. I'm not sure. 
I can't really tell from the picture. But I like that. I'm going to do I'm going to do if it's not true. <laughs> Doesn't matter. It also addresses more godmothers. Because not all godmothers have blue eyes. Really so godmothers with green eyes and grey eyes and black brown eyes. And uh, what's it called? Um, al al albino. What color eyes have albino? Red eyes? This is not really blue. So in this case I'll use my own pencils. You see the difference? Look! Oh, that's a pity. Yeah, that doesn't help for viewer pleasure. Okay.
this, this is it. It's enough. Mm -hmm. So. And then we say God or God Mother or God Mother. Or I had a very nervous weekend. Or what you say, I had a very nervous weekend. I had a very nervous weekend. I'm nervous. Yeah, not so much. I had a very nervous we still want to have the gold mother, isn't it? God. God. Not God. God and God here. What is God? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <It's fun. coughs> Sorry, God, mother, or I make another mother here, or oh, any mother there. Not sure, but the mother. Oh God. Uh, I think that would be it.